Hello Virgo, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. Chameleon spirit, act as if. And this brings in change. Now what we're doing here, was act, we're acting as if we've already achieved our goals. As if, you know, we're trusting and having faith in our ability to get there. And sometimes when we act as if we have already got what we've achieved, it moves things along quicker. Now is a lucky time, rabbit spirit, a lucky time. So envisage what you want your life to be. It's, it's definitely that. Act as if you've already achieved your goals and it will spur you forward. The death card, which is Scorpio energy. That might be relevant for some of you. The Ten of Swords. The Page of Pentacles. The Two of Wands. The Ten of Pentacles, which is overall central energy. The Eight of Wands. The Judgment card. The Seven of Swords. The Five of Pentacles. Now we've got disappointment here, feeling left out in the cold and abandoned. And what we have here is somebody trying to get away with something. Uh, it could be an environment as well that's not sitting well with you. But there's something coming to light here that's going to change everything. And it's happening for a reason. So we can't, you know, stay in this disappointed energy. It's almost as if you feel your cup's half full instead of half empty here. We need to let these disappointments go. Fives are change. Um, we need to take this information and use it in our own best interests here. Now, you're definitely going to have to make a judgment call. And this is a transformation. It's not just a simple change here. There's a transformation. So whatever's coming to light here is transforming your situation. And this, de this uh, big pardon, Scorpio en uh, energy, this death card here, is about out with the old and in with the new. Now, luck is on your side here. So there's a judgment call you need to make. And it's going to put an end to all your anxieties, this disappointing cycle that you've been going through. So it's a very important judgment call. This is ending things. You're not prepared to put up with things anymore as they are. You're not being prepared to put, you're not prepared to go through the mental anxiety of whatever this is that's causing this for you. Now it could be finances, it could be jobs, relationships, or environments. This judgment call is a major one. And what's happening here is their spirit is trying to help you make it and they're saying base, base it on the knowledge that you've gained up till now. So if there's deja vu situations going on where there's no improvement, it's time to change. It's time for a change. If there's deceptive people or people letting you down, it's time to make a judgment call in relation to that and bring in the changes and really shut it all down. You need to shut this all down. So let go of the disappointments here. Understand that these things are happening here because you need to make these changes. There's a major decision that needs to be made here, a judgment call, and it's you that's going to have to make it. So focus on what you have in the present, definitely. And this is choices. You're making change, you're bringing in change, you're making a major decision here to get you onto a more fruitful path, a more abundant path for you. So act as if here, you've already achieved things. Let all this go, this disappointment go, this deception go, this environment, whatever's causing this feeling that, you know, life's not working out for you here. Let it go. Uh, act as if you've already achieved what it is that you're wanting. Your intuition will definitely guide you here. And this is about bringing more stable situations into your life. Now, you could be studying here. You could be gathering information that's going to help you with the choices you're making. But it's definitely about becoming informed. The more informed you become, the more inspired you will become. So think about your stability. It's about the start of something new here. Transformation. Everything is right at this moment for you to get onto this new path and make this judgment call that's necessary. And what will happen here is the good news will come in. Things will fall into place. Now, you could be going on a holiday of your dreams here just to get a break. You could also be moving house, moving job, moving country. There could be emails and texts coming in with regards to study courses or new opportunities for jobs here that you're looking at. But whatever you're doing, you're leaving all this behind. The Seven of Swords energy behind and the Five of Pentacles energy. So things are going to start to grow for you. And the way to bring things on and to make things move quicker is to trust and believe and imagine that you already have achieved your goals. So don't sit in this energy here. Don't feel disappointed. Use it as a pivot as a stone to push yourself forward here, to bounce off of 
to change things. And the more inspired you become, the more successful and the quicker things will happen. And what happens is you bring in abundance and prosperity into your life. Now, this could be improvements in finances. Eventually, as a 10, we have to work towards the 10. So we're committing to this new path. And it takes time, but there will be prosperity at the end of this. There'll be abundance at the end of it. So this could be support networks that are helping you, family members, good friends that are helping you at this time as well. But it also is the right people showing up to support you with your new goals and this new venture that you're taking up, this new path that you're on. So, you know, there's a lot to be gained here. And like we said, luck is definitely on your side. So don't be frightened of this change. Act on this. Don't sit in this disappointing energy. Use it to pivot yourself forward to more prosperous opportunities. Archangel Metatron. Archangel Metatron. I am your link between heaven and earth, between your humanity and your divinity. I am here to help you heal the conflict that exists between your heart and mind. Feel me in your heart and thoughts. Through oneness there is love. So this is about healing, getting over these situations here. And remember, like I said, Spirit is supporting you at this time with this judgment call. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.